Howdy everyone, my name is Jaeger Spice, and welcome to a new show I like to call an overly detailed analysis. This will be an overly detailed analysis of Yi. Yi was uploaded in 2012. I know I didn't have to scroll down to check the date. I, I know this off the top of my head. I, I researched very hard. Yi is a video that is 9 seconds long. But as every English major knows, a second is a thousand years in details. So, let us go over the Yi video, second by second, and we shall analyze it and understand the deep complexities. So, the first thing we have is the beginning screen, the beginning shot, the beginning ideas of this film. And we see a dinosaur. Um, he seems to be happy. Or she, I have no idea. They seem to be happy. Um, if not a bit nervous. And uh, I think that might be because of the matte painting in the back. Um, but I'm not sure. That's, that's, no, who knows. And if we look right in this region, we can see horns all over the place. Now, Revelation tells us that a ten-horned beast will come. So could this be a video talking about the end times? You know, perhaps an omen that this is the, the ten-horned beast. Who knows? I think maybe. Let's see what he has to say. So right off the bat, he is speaking nonsense. Um, what would we also know about that? Speaking in tongues. That's right. That's right. This is the beast from Revelation. Ten horns and seven crowns. Or seven horns and ten crowns. I don't really remember. We know it. <laughs> is what it is. He is speaking in tongues. This is not a meme. This is a video. That is a direct link the end times, an animation of what the creator assumed the end times would be. This is so intense. It's, it's not a conspiracy. This is a theory. This is a theory on what this is. Of course, this is not truly a demon. It is just a cute dinosaur. Wrong! This is an interpretation of the devil himself. Or the beast. The monster. Magog, Gog. This is the omen. Ye is the omen. It is an omen. A description of what they think will happen. We can see it. <sighs> Need I say more? Ye and here we see the next, the next beast. Now, in initial, in initial studies on this scene, I presupposed that this was Satan. But, upon further review, I actually believe this to be an interpretation of God. Now, if you look in the back, there is a tree right here. And if you will see, there are purple uh, plants upon this tree. Now this tree looks very foreign, very alien. I've actually never seen a tree like it. So, um, if we look in Genesis, we can see that the Garden of Eden um, has a tree of knowledge. The fruit is lost time. And so, really, what this is showing is the fruit of knowledge. This is not a monster. This is an interpretation of God. Now, whether you think that's sacrilegious or not, that's up to your interpretation. Uh, you know, many sects, you know, draw him in different ways. But I think this is it. This is it. So, we have here the ten-horned beast. And here, God himself coming down for salvation. The fruit of knowledge in the back, that's beautiful. 
this is a beautiful story, really. If you look at it, it, it just really details how much, you know, time and effort went into this complex understanding of culture over the years. You know, it, so yeah, it's, it's, it's very, very interesting, very interesting. Now, let's continue on. And here we see the final panel. Now, this is what brings it all together. This is what brings the entire Yi video together. Many interpret this as just two dinosaurs talking it out. You know, one going wah 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 or ba 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 ba. You know, we don't know. We don't know. It's you know the pronunciations have been lost to time. Nobody knows how dinosaurs talk. But then we get the Yi. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. And I don't I don't want to be one sound silly. But we do know that in Hebrew, Jesus is not, you know, Jesus. There is no just sound in Hebrew. So instead, there is a ya sound. That's right, everyone. Ye does not stand for just ye. Ye stands for Jesus. This is the monster calling for all hell to break loose. And this right here is God calling for Jesus. This is a video that depicts the end times. It is so beautiful. So beautifully depicted. And in this final shot, we see the beast broken before us. It's beautiful, really. You can see his eyes. He's tired. He's defeated. The monster has called for Yi, and the beast has failed. Has lost. It's really, truly a beautiful video. And... Honestly, I just, you know, I, I can't think about all of the effort that must have went into creating it. And so, yeah, I think, you know, this is a very important uh, relic to time. And so that's how this video ends. I will see all of you next time for another overly detailed analysis. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like and a subscription if you do so, please. And if not, well, have a great life. I'll see you later.